I would absolutely love if you would subscribe to this channel. So click the little subscribe button and you will be notified of all of the rankings, interviews, recaps, and previews. Hi everybody, I'm Andrew Walker and I'm from Maple Valley Christmas and Three Wise Men and a Baby and I'm on Hallmark Happenings. Thank you for having me, Betsy. Oh my gosh, thank you for coming back on. But let's talk quickly about Three Wise Men and a Baby. So I'm wondering who came up with this concept and what were your thoughts when they approached you with this idea? Um, well, it was Paul uh, Campbell who and Kimberly Sustad, his writing partner, who came up with this, with the concept. I have to be honest, I can't talk too much about it because it's uh, we're going to be doing interviews after the movie airs. And I need to be with, I want to be doing these interviews with, with the guys too. Um, but no, Paul, Paul and Kimberly came up with the idea. There was some murmurs about us potentially doing like a, a three men and a baby type story. And, um, and they just took it, ran with it and came up with the script and the story is beyond anything I could have imagined. And it, ex it exceeded all expectations and also getting to work with those two guys, you know, was, uh, was really, really special. Wow. Yeah. It'll be fun to do like a, the trio interview with all three of y'all. Uh, this is going to be, this is going to break records. Like this is going to break the ratings. I know when it airs uh, this, everyone's so hyped about this and you know, the fans are so smart. They, they caught on to this like way, way before it was like officially announced. I was just seeing stuff. online. I, I don't even know where they get some of the content from, you know, when I look on social media and I go, I, I never knew this picture existed. I never knew like, it was like, they're almost like, you know, taking these, these, the, they're, they were in a, you know, staking out the set you know from their car or something and taking pictures of us there's 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 things that that pop up in places that i never even i feel like i've never i've never i was never even there i never even took that picture fans yeah the fans but that's the beauty of these fans right hallmark fans are the best fans in the world like we we are so fortunate to be doing these movies for the people that watch these movies and our community is only growing you know, these, these movies with how diverse the storylines are now and, you know, integrating, you know, the, the movie that, um, uh, oh my gosh, I'm blanking on, uh, on uh, Benjamin Ayers did uh, about the girl with Down syndrome. Like Hallmark wasn't doing these stories. They weren't doing these stories a year and a, two, a year and a half, two years ago, but now they're doing these stories. They're starting the Mahogany Network, you know, which is that, that extension of Hallmark. And these are all things that just needed to happen. And I think that it's, it's so good for the network. It's so exciting for us as actors on the network to be able to, to work for a, a network that is all inclusive like this and really is trying to um, broaden the storylines and, um, and bring in, you know, actors that are, look at Peyton List, fresh actors, fresh faces, you know, and so I'm, I just feel like I'm a passenger on this incredible, on this incredible journey with, with a, you know, a really exciting network. Yeah. It's amazing. Uh, kudos to them. And I think like when someone like you, you've done 20 plus of these movies, I think to keep bringing back these like veteran, like such beloved actors, you've got to give them something new and something fresh because people want that and uh, the actors as well. So I think it must be so fun for all of y'all to, to be like, okay, what's coming out next? What script are you going to offer me next? <laughs> I know, I know. Yeah, I think Maple Valley Christmas is probably the, the the most classic Hallmark movie that I've done in a little while, which is really nice because people that's the that's great. What they're doing right now is they're mixing the old with the new and they're bringing things that are a little more familiar back as well as throwing things out there like three wise men and a baby for people. That it's just like so outside off, you know, outside the box of the normal Hallmark model, you know, so um. Yeah, no, it's it's a it's a very exciting time to be to be a part of this, be a part of this network. It really is. It's like something for everyone. And then of course with Holiday Spectacular, they're doing a period project, which is so rare. And I'm so excited right? to see them just switch it up yeah. and then have like three male leads. Like it's just amazing. Uh, huge kudos yeah. to everyone in that creative department for figuring this all out. <laughs> yeah, it's it's Wanya and it's Wanya Lucas, Lisa Hamilton Daly, um, you know. The, the, all the marketing girls, you know, Annie Howell and Maureen Barrett, um, you know, and all the execs, Jennifer, Jennifer Kramer and, and uh, Samantha DePepo and Liz Yost. And, you know, and of course, you know, 
I, I, it's funny because Randy Pope is like the only like guy now left there, but it's all these these insanely smart women that he's surrounded around now. And you see what you see. What I you know I I was saying it to my wife when we were in New York. I was like, see what happens when you know when when a whole bunch of women become the the network exact you know become the the uh, the hierarchy at the network. All we're it's elevating it's elevating the entire uh, you know experience for us. Who runs the world? Girls. <laughs> girls. Girls run the world. They should run it more. They should run it more too. I second that. <laughs> well, that's, <laughs> that's awesome. And uh, before you finish up, I do want to remind everyone, is it tomorrow? Does your movie already come out tomorrow? Is that right? My movie airs tomorrow. Yeah. Good timing for this, this, uh, this segment with you and I. Oh, it yes. I've, that's amazing. Everyone tune in to Hallmark Movies and Mysteries tomorrow, November 5th. That's a Saturday. You don't want to miss Andrew Walker and a Maple Valley Christmas. It's going to be awesome. I love that they're still giving the fans who want the classics that. So this will definitely appeal to syrup fans and classic Hallmark fans alike. Um, oh, yeah. But I do have a quick question before we finish up. So we can't talk much about Three Wise Men and a Baby, but that video you put up, were you like shocked at like the response? Because I mean, it was breaking the internet. <laughs> it was crazy. Yeah, no, we, um, right when we put those elf outfits on, we, we knew we wanted to do something fun with it. Tyler just went right. He just got right after it. Like Tyler's, Tyler's a, a little, he's a filmmaker, you know, he's super talented and he, he was just like, he was like, he knew what we had to do immediately. And so, so he just got to town on like videoing, videoing he took, and then Paul videoed him. I was videoing the both of them shooting their things and, and then Tyler edited it together. And yeah, it was, I think Tyler got like 120,000 likes on it on TikTok or something, you know, he, so it was, and we have a few more, we have a few more little, little nuggets that we're going to, we're going to spread over the next, the course of the next two weeks and some BTS stuff. Thank you so much for listening. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. If you love all things up TV, Hallmark channel, GAC family, basically all of your made for TV movie channels, click that subscribe button. So you don't miss out on any of the previews, the recaps or the interviews until next time. Thank you so much for listening to Hallmark happenings. Have a great day.